today I'm taking you shopping with me in Hobby Lobby. We are going to see what they have that is new in home decor, tableware, and in their spring shop. I even have some great high-end look for less items that I'll be sharing with you. and welcome to today's video. We are in Hobby Lobby shopping. We're going to see what is new. My store has added some new home decor and they have expanded their spring shop with some new items that I wanna share so many great things here so let's jump right on in i always find the best vessels vases and containers this white flower pot was so pretty i loved the lower profile of it i actually purchased this and styled it in my recent kitchen video and i am in love with it it reminds me of ironstone ware and for eleven dollars and fifty cents you can't beat that price Hobby Lobby also had these two bubble vases. They had the large one and the shorter one. These are very popular and the texture is great and adds character to your home decor. Another very popular and on trend item right now are these head statue vases. They are so fun to style and you can do so many different things with them to incorporate them into your home decor. And if you don't already have just a simple flower vase, this tulip vase in this white ceramic is a good staple. And this rib vase is perfect if you're looking for a more sleek design, perfect for fresh cut or faux flowers. This next item literally just hit Hobby Lobby shelves and it is a perfect dupe for the very expensive Anthropology Minka vase. I was so excited to find this and not only share it with you, but bring it home and style it. I don't know if these large oversized pots are new to Hobby Lobby or just new to my store, but this was the first time I had seen them. They were fabulous. The texture, the color, I loved them so much. This three handle pot is a great high end look for less for this Joshua Pottery Barn handcrafted ceramic vase. A great find for a fraction of the cost. If you follow along with my decorating here in my home, you know I love the blue and white ceramics. I love chinoiserie and I could not leave Hobby Lobby without highlighting some of the pieces that they have. So many things. I I have bought a vase here and they have these ginger jars or canisters. These would be so pretty to style on your kitchen counter for your flour and sugar. They also had a lot of blue and white planters in different styles and shapes. So a wide selection to choose from. greenery and flowering stems to fill our beautiful containers and vases so I always love to stop by and check out what they have in their floral section. These mini greenery stems are a wonderful thing to keep in your decor stash to decorate with. I love to tuck these in and amongst my decor it helps to break up and soften any harsh lines. It also helps to bring that outdoors in especially here during the spring and summer months. I also wanted to share with you a few of these floral stems that caught my eye. The soft color palette is so dainty and pretty here for spring and summer. These are also things that you could blend in and transition into fall. I love to pick flowers that will be used multiple times throughout the year. These purple cone flowers were really pretty 
and I liked the drapiness of these wisteria type stems. I don't know if that's exactly what this is. If you know the exact flower, drop me a comment below. And these looked like cherry blossoms. They were on an extra long stem, making them perfect for oversized faces. I have these wispy green stems and love them. They look really good mixed in with flowers or in a vase by themselves. The perfect staple piece to add to your home decor. I had never noticed all of these brass figurines and statues in my Hobby Lobby before. Does your store have these? Look how cute these are, and you can see the yellow clearance tag on a lot of these. I'm seeing that pop up more and more in my Hobby Lobby. A very on-trend popular item to decorate with are these table knots. I really liked these unique brass shapes. The spheres were also nice and came in two different sizes. I am now moving on to shop in the spring shop. While a lot of this has been in store for a while now, I have not seen the furniture in the spring shop featured in a whole lot of videos. So I wanted to share that with you here in case you were looking for little unique furniture pieces. Everything in the spring shop is 40% off and I suspect that will increase in the discount as we go along into the summer months but if you want it you better grab it now because when these things sell out they're not likely to restock them there was a great selection of these little tables in tables coffee table nesting table so many things to choose from I will try to link as many things as I can but shopping in store is probably your best bet to find most of this These chairs are so interesting and fun. We get a lot of dust where I am, so this black would be brown, and I could never keep up with it with all the dirt, but it's very pretty for your patio. This little bistro set was dainty and cute. It has a plastic woven seat and top to it, and everything folds up, so if you want to store it away, it would be easy to do that, and the whole set of three was $175. Dollars. Hobby Lobby brings out dishes and glassware, all kinds of tableware in the spring. This year, I think they have hit it out of the ballpark with the selection. Again, so many of the beautiful blue and white that I love. They had the shatterproof melamine. They also had the breakable dishes here. They have an aesthetic and a style that will match anybody's decor out there. So if you are looking for new dishes sets head into Hobby Lobby and check it out again don't forget the spring shop items here are 40% off pattern on this set of dishes was very pretty and this was melamine. It would be able to transition to outside and use it on your patio without worrying about glass getting broken. It had the full set, the dinner plates, the bowls, the salad plates, mix and match the styles. It also had the serving pieces and everything that went along with this pattern. It is the Market Square brand. I don't know if it will be around after the spring spring and they take down their spring shop so I will have to see about that but great options and can I just talk about the beautiful plastic glasses they had stemware they had hobnail glasses 
and they were available in different sizes. They had some with a stem, juice glasses, and then the regular size glasses. They had multiple colors. I really, really, really liked the clear hobnail glasses with the short stem. the Stanley dupe tumblers in the fall. They sold out so quick, but they have finally restocked them here at Hobby Lobby. Love these. These make great gifts. They keep your drink hot or cold, and I think for a much cheaper price point, they are just as good or better than a Stanley. These are great little tumblers. I highly recommend them. My Hobby Lobby just stocked all of this merchandise I'm about to show you. This is a great look for less dupe of a bog bag. It was well made, looked almost identical. So for a fraction of the price, grab you one of these. It's a great little pool or beach bag. This little makeup bag in this terry cloth checked pattern was also new to the spring shop at my Hobby Lobby. I thought it was a great little size to just carry things in your beach bag, purse, or suitcase. The cap was super cute. It is not too early to be thinking about Mother's Day and graduation gifts. A lot of these items would be perfect for either of those occasions. The pink visor would be perfect for the pool or beach. They had these little terry cloth glasses case and they came with a fun little pair of sunglasses inside. These nylon crossbody bags are a wonderful dupe for a free people design. They are a catch-all. You can use these to travel or when you're out running errands. Really cute. I bought this lighter colored bag to take on a recent trip. There are no pockets or inner zippers or anything like that. It's just an open single compartment bag. Hobby Lobby also had these knit shorts. They had an elastic waist with an adjustable drawstring. They had pockets. The inseam looked like it was maybe an inch, inch and a half long. Very basic, but very comfortable short to throw on over a swimsuit or to run around for errands during these hot summer months that are coming up. They came in a variety of colors and looked like they would fit true to size. The spring shop at Hobby Lobby also just put out all of this exercise and gym equipment. The first thing I'm showing here is a gym bag. I purchased this bag and took it on the same trip as that other nylon crossbody. It has four compartments, a zipper with little interior pockets, and it has a compartment for shoes on the side. It was a great carry on it held everything I needed and then had extra room for all my souvenirs coming home. If you need a good yoga bag, this one will carry your mat. It has room for all your other yoga accessories with the little mesh pockets. It closes up and keeps everything secure and then the strap that you can carry it over your shoulder with. I was really surprised to see these waist belt bags here at Hobby Lobby. These are perfect when you just want to carry your phone or your keys. I was also surprised by all of the workout and gym equipment and accessories at Hobby Lobby of all places. Everything was in these fun purple and pink colors, the massage roller, the yoga blocks, and the kettlebells. 
I know that I normally only share home decor, so this is a little bit out of that niche, but this was too good not to share with you. So when you're in Hobby Lobby getting home decor, take a look around and see what else they might have that you need or want. My Hobby Lobby has all of their Memorial Day and 4th of July patriotic merchandise out. If you would like to see a video exclusively on that, let me know in the comments and I will definitely get that together for you. But I am just highlighting a few things here to show you what caught my eye as I made this initial pass through. But like I said, I will definitely share it if you would like to watch. Thank you so much for spending your precious time here with me shopping at Hobby Lobby. We were all over the store and saw a lot of great stuff. If you enjoyed it, I appreciate when you hit that thumbs up. I invite you to subscribe, ring your bell, and come back for the next video. Until then, I hope you have the most wonderful and blessed day. I'll see you again real soon.